morning out there in the DFS community. It's Vaughn, the Stat Man, coming into your YouTube airwaves, and welcome to the Stat Room. All right, ladies and gentlemen, before I get into the good and the phenomenal that happened in DFS tonight, let me get into my positive word. And my positive word tonight, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen is celebrate. I am going to celebrate. All right, ladies and gentlemen, whenever you have some good news, you celebrate. You get a raise, you celebrate. You land a new role, if you're an actor, celebrate. You write a new script, celebrate. You hit the lotto, you celebrate. You get the girl of your dreams, celebrate. You get the man of your dreams, celebrate. Every time you achieve a goal, ladies and gentlemen, like if you say, all right, this week, I'm gonna do 40 sit-ups every day, and you met that goal, celebrate. It's okay to celebrate. It's nothing wrong with celebrating your accomplishments, ladies. You have to celebrate because you have a lot of ugliness in this world. So it's okay to celebrate good times. Come on. I know I can't sing and I don't even care. But I had a phenomenal night. And I got a phenomenal lady and I got a phenomenal son. And I got a phenomenal mother. So I'm celebrating. And my grandmother is doing better. So I'm going to celebrate. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so here we go. Tonight, I had another 200 plus lineup. I was responsible for over $5,000 in winnings. Yes, a guy put my lineup in the $25 game and won $2,500, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, and he played the lineup twice. It was a 215 score. It's on my Twitter, if you don't believe me, for all you haters and doubters. And I actually won all my head-to-head -head contests with my score of a 122.9. And I won my other head-to-head -head with a 141.3. So tonight is my fourth night in a row cashing. I love all of my VIPs. Tonight... My VIPs, I was I know y'all gotta be happy. Well, I already got one email. It was like, thank you that they won big. So I already know what it did. Now tonight, I didn't put it in a big GPP. I came in fourth place in the 250 prize pool. So I came in fourth place. This lineup tonight would have would have placed bit well and it'll cash in anything. I'm getting better each day, guys. This is my fourth day in a row. Guys, I'm just so happy. So it's enough with that, man. I'm a, um, I'm gonna say I had um, I picked a pitcher catcher from um, from Houston, and I'm not gonna go through the lineup because if you want to see it, go on my Twitter page and see it. All right, guys. So all right, I celebrated enough. So now it's time to bring it back down, and I am on to today. All right, so let me do my four horsemen for today. It's pitcher Kiatu. He's going up against Philly. They are the absolute worst hitting team in all of baseball right now. They they just can't seem to hit the ball. So I'm going with Kiatu. I'm going with first base Reynolds. He's um in San Diego. That's a good hitter's park. And I feel like t tomorrow will be his night. Spain is, is going to give Kiato hitter support in Philly tomorrow. And I feel like, all right, Philly didn't score at all. They didn't have any runs. A major league baseball team is not going to have zero in back-to-back -back days. So I believe outfield Kendricks will get on the board. Kiato always gives up at least two runs. And we'll take that because they'll probably get eight strikeouts. But I think that Kendricks is going to get a hit and he might even get a home run. So that's my four horsemen for tomorrow. And just advice for guys when you play in DFS. Someone asked me, like, what, what do I do in DFS? All right, and explain what it is. All right, DFS is DFS is daily fantasy strategy, and what it is is I help people to pick lineups so they can win money. And in MLB, your goal is you want to have a pitcher, you want to have a catcher, you want to have a first baseman, a second baseman, a third baseman, a shortstop, and three outfielders. Now, when you're picking your lineups. You have to look at matchups. You have to definitely check the weather. The weather is huge. If it's windy, then the ball might not carry. If the wind, if the, if the ball blows, is blowing to the right, and you have left, and you have a, a, a lineup with all left-handed batters, they probably won't get home runs. So all of that matters. And guys, 
it's all about the pitchers. If you get your pitcher right and you get three hitters to do well, you can do well. Um, but make sure you get your pitchers right and make sure you do your research. If you don't want to do research, then you contact a guy like me who I, I did two hours worth of research tonight, guys, and you saw the results. You know, a lot of people don't have ten, two hours, so they contact me. So, yes, that's um, what I did tonight. If you have any other questions, guys, I'll answer all of your questions, man. I love each and every person that watches my videos. And, hey, like this video. If you don't like this video tonight, you're just a hater. Because what can you not like about somebody getting a 215? The only way you won't like it is if you are a DFS provider and you're jealous. That's it. But other than that, man, I'm just happy. I love you guys. Don't forget to win-win. Don't forget to think and ink. And I am on to today. Love y'all.